Good morning, friends. I mentioned in one of those earlier recorder videos that I would teach you how to draw a treble clef, and I'm going to do that now. I'll also teach you a bass clef, just in case you want to be learning some lower notes that the left hand usually plays on the piano. First, we're going to start with the treble clef or G clef. On the staff, I start a little bit above and draw a straight line down to a little bit below. That's a little bit crooked, but I try to do it straight. From a little bit above to a little bit below, the next step is to make a capital D going to line four. One, two, three, four. So I start a little bit above, go a little bit below, make a capital D to line four, and then I draw a C down to the bottom line. You can do all this, the D and the C, without picking up your pencil. From above the staff to below, straight line, capital D, then a C, and then it comes around like a G, and it wraps back around to the second line. That's the G line right there, empty garbage before dad flips. That's one reason this is called a G clef. Now we're not quite done yet. From above the staff to below, straight line, we do our capital D, we do a C, bring it around like a G, tie it up onto that second line, and then you get to give it a tail. And there you have a treble clef. After you've drawn some more, you can circle your best ones. Now let's take a look at bass clef. In case you want to do those bottom notes for the left hand, it's actually called an F clef or bass clef. And we would start on line four, one, two, three, four, which by the way is the F line. That's it. So here's how I did that. I counted up one, two, three, four. I always start counting at the bottom. That's the F line. I put a little dot on it. From there, I go up to line five, then down, almost like the shape of an ear, and right around line two, I stop, and then I need a colon. Those two little dots go right above and below the F line, and that's an F clef. So you have treble clef or G clef, and you have bass clef or F clef. I'll draw one more for you. One, two, three, four. Line four, put a dot on it. From that dot, curve upward to the top line, line five, down towards the first line, but stop before you get there. And then draw a dot above and below the fourth line or the F line. There you go. Have fun, you guys. Bye.